Hey guys, it's Demon, and well, welcome back. <laughs> I um, I was just I got all the candles and campfires down for Plantera, and then it said something with a potion, which means she's she's gonna come. So I just started recording. I showed you guys what I did off camera, the stuff that we got. Plantera favorite item to gain increase gab range. I don't really care. Uh, treasure bag. Here we go. I don't think. Yeah, we need a living shard. Spore sack. Nothing crazy. We have the temple key. Um, yeah, let's get all the keys on us. Living shards, I believe, is something huge. <coughs> yeah. So we can get the tail disc, but we need the thorn. Shake meal? Shake ram? Whatever. Oh, crap. That's the melee. Yeah, here, here's the rogue. So we can... We need that. <laughs> Um, anything else? Um, no. <coughs> hmm, does not seem like that. Yeah, no, okay, so let's get this. So we need this real quick. Let's hope we can make that. What is it called? Oh, I saw it. Here you go. <coughs> I can't believe we're about to get our first Taylor weapon. Fun fact, I only have used a um, the Taylor blade one time. Ever. And I never used it. I don't know why. I don't ask me, but yeah. Holy crap, I could have just bought the uh, melee one by accident. That would have sucked. Yeah, I think this weapon's gonna get gone now because we have this. So yeah, off camera, I farmed the items I said, the poison bomb, <coughs> was an upgrade to the um, sea foam bomb, and then I got the items to craft this, which gives us 25% more speed. I have a light, like shine, thing around me all the time, 5% damage reduction and life regen, poison freeze, chill, frostburn, and venom. I'm mute to. I get the honey buff and bees slash hornets do 75% more damage to me and I have cold protection, cold, sorry, not cold, uh, protection in death mode. <coughs> so, big buff, we, we, as you saw, I take knockback now, which is kind of, I'm not used to it, and as you saw, I took a lot of damages because of the knockback. We have to try to get the, we have to try to get flawless on this. Flawless right there. 82 gold. Okay. 300 damage. Wow. <coughs> yeah, so we're gonna do that with this is number two. As you can see, it's just three of these. It's kind of like um, our first ever hard mode weapon. I can't remember what it's called. But yeah, it's just like that. Um, I didn't get the, sh the fin weapon, which kind of made... I'm kind of upset. Um, <coughs> actually, hold on.
<coughs> hey guys. Uh, I'm back. <coughs> so, something's always gonna happen. I'm gonna show my black screen like you guys just saw. And... Which illusion? Wait. Time lapse? Whatever. I top stopped the recording there. And went to go farm this guy from Bama, and we actually got it now. <coughs> so now we have this guy from Bama. That's what I did off camera. And I just did the same thing I did before. So it looks like I actually didn't um, stop the recording, but I technically did. So, yeah, let's do this real quick. Let's try to get flawless. There you go. Flawless suit try, baby. Okay. <coughs> um. Yeah, let's get all the keys, and we're gonna have to go into the dungeon. Yeah, long time since we said the dungeon. I haven't been there in a very long time. Oh, do we really only have these keys? I swear we had more. Okay, well that sucks. I'm gonna have to look for the um, temple key after this. I mean, dungeon. <coughs> but if I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, we have a Leviathan before we do anything. Leviathan, Ashram, and then Golem. Yeah, so we have two more bosses before Golem, but you could fight Golem right now, and he's still a pushover, by the way. What am I doing? I can go buy a dungeon potion. <coughs> Ugh, my throat. Nope, nope, there you go. Give me temple. What do you have? <coughs> so good, that gives more low items. Oh. <coughs> That's right. I don't care. Let's go. So we need to farm ectoplasm. Um, we need to find ectoplasm and the paladin's hammer. So, we're going to use our new Terra disc. One thing that sucks about this weapon is that you can't just spam it. You have to wait for all three of them to come back. <coughs> oh, my throat again. But, besides that, it's actually a really great weapon. Oh, there's our first two ectoplasm. Yeah, we're gonna have to just find a good spot that we can grind and just keep killing them. Ow, 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 stop that, stop it, stop it. Go away, go away, go away. God damn it, stop. You butthole. Also, it shoots through walls, so yeah, we can kill the enemy before he even gets to us. Also, there's occasions like that where there were like four enemies and I just summoned like 10,000 stuff. Post plantar loot tokens, also. Those are a scene, and I don't actually fully know what we can get from this. Oh, crap! Okay! We can even get the paladin's hammer? Oh, my god! And there's the key brand, not key blade. Um. <coughs> <coughs> Yeah, so I guess we will be making, if we get enough tokens before we get the Paladin's Hammer, we'll just make Paladin Hammer out of that. But, I think we might get it beforehand, I don't know. Oh. We need more him. So yeah, we're just gonna keep exploring our dungeon until we get enough, we need a lot of ectoplasm. I need like... <coughs> <coughs> I actually have no idea. I need like 300. So that's what this entire episode is probably going to be. Getting 300 ectoplasm and the paladin's hammer so we can upgrade our opponent's hammer. So it's actually super good. Like when I mean super good, I mean like next upgrade is I think the second best or third best rogue weapon in the game. <coughs> <coughs> So, but that, I think that is post sp Supreme Calamitous, so, I mean, I'm not getting that anytime soon, of course. Yeah, this, uh, tablet is so, like, 
double-edged sword because if I miss and as you saw I just couldn't attack anymore that's why but I could also just ooh crap I also can just like hit everything if I, I kill anything if I hit <coughs> I don't know this weapon on bosses, so maybe we'll try it on bosses. It seems like a really strong weapon against bosses. Here, yeah, how about at the end of the episode, we'll try to beat Supreme Calamitous. Not Supreme Calamitous, well, just Calamitous. With this, uh, with Terror Spikes. Oh, we're going, oh. oh. Let's just kind of get rid of all the spikes, because, you know. Let's try Skyfin Bomb. Ooh, yeah, Skyfin Bomb was really good. <coughs> it also hones, by the way. Stop, stop, stop. Woo! That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Stop it. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. What? What? Okay. No, Ectoplasm. <coughs> so this is after Ext Astralum? What is his name? I can't remember. That's afterwards, so... I just wanted to make it so we know where it is afterwards. Yeah, I should probably get some Veneration Potions and, uh... Some more Dungeon Tokens. Whoa! Whoa! I can just make that. Well, that's cool. <coughs> <coughs> so, what does the temp. Oh, right here. Whoa, that's cool. Okay, I think we have to fight Plantera more then. Make five and let's get four of those. I don't know if I'm gonna die that much, but. Maybe. I am. I'm not the best player in the world, so. Oh, more ectoblood. By the way, ectoblood just transform into ectoplasm, so... We want ectoblood and ectoplasm. <coughs> Go away. More ectoblood that we missed? Yeah, even enemies with like a 10k HP or like a thousand HP, we like still do insane damage. We just gotta hit them, <coughs> and then we can start doing the chain reaction of damage. Oh my god, we just passed the frost chest like a dummy. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, mini boss, mini boss. God, I hate this magic guy. I hate him in the real world games too. So, I guess kind of makes sense, huh? Okay, we beat him. He gives us like five ectoplasm. Yeah, six ectoplasm. That's insane. Okay, there goes flash dresses. You should stop it. I could feel my HP dying. So, what are we looking for again? Jungle chest, <coughs> which summons uh the piranhas, which are useless to us, but I just kind of like having them there, so. Boom. So this is a sentry summon. It does really great damage if you're like staying at one spot, so. Why am I so slow? Ooh, boo witching table, boo witching table, there you go. He's dead anytime soon. There you go. Three ectopod. I think it's actually guaranteed to have three or higher from that point. So if we can find more of those guys, that would be great. Oh, we got Wiss in the bottle. I love this one. This is like a cool flying... Oh, there's the paladin somewhere. Oh, there he is. He's up there. Yeah, we're just, we're just gonna cheat him like this. <coughs> and while we're doing that, we're gonna get rid of some items that we don't need in our inventory. So we can get more items.
There we go. Summoning up there, summoning up there. Okay, there you go. No! I'm gonna die. Ah, uh, he has 17 HP. <coughs> I don't care, we got Whisp in the bottle. That's like my favorite, um, light pet. <coughs> I think. Also, like, it follows when you move, so that's why it's kind of one of my favorites. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, no, we're not dealing with this. Hey. Hey. Screw you guys. <coughs> Butt cheeks. Oh, crap. Yeah, I haven't, like, barely fished. I think I'm gonna get rid of the bug net. Do I need anything else for a hammer? <coughs> like for building? But I really think I'm done with building. <laughs> so we're gonna get rid of that. And we're also gonna get rid of that because we don't need that either. Just put those in there. <coughs> temple keys, temple key. I don't know what that did. Okay, cool. Ectoplasm and ecto blood. Let's see how much we can make with this ecto. Okay. And if we press O, do that. <coughs> do that too. I wasn't even thinking about that. So they added more range in melee weapons, <coughs> but no, Rogue, how could you? But this is so broken, so we're not actually get this. <laughs> uh, we need lots of silk. Silk. We're gonna have to make as much as we can. That should be good, actually. And then it's, oh, fantasy card. Oh, what? Here we go, what are we missing? Oh, ectopod, I don't have it in there. I'm stupid. Here we go. So we need... <coughs> oh no, we have no more ectoplasm, but we do have this now. <coughs> We're actually gonna get rid of the poison bomb. <laughs> we really did not use it at all. We're actually gonna get rid of the scorch too. But we got this weapon right here. This is, as you can see, doesn't look like a crazy weapon. But let's fight Calamitous and see how well we do now. Here we go. Where is he? I don't know if we're gonna win. I'm just trying to test. Look at that. So it's summon. It's su every time you hit the enemy, it's some. Uh, yeah, summons homing, like light fiends that do insane damage. <coughs> and this is just absolutely nuts. That's as you can just see. It's so crazy, and this looks amazing for my vampire weapon, because it means more projectiles, which also means more HP. So yeah, it's kind of an insane weapon. Like as you can see, like everything's just dying. I mean, I know this is post Plantera, but <clears throat> actually, the recommendation is to fight Plantera and then fight Calamitous. So I mean, this is just to show you how broken it is. <laughs> like you saw that the battle was kind of challenging and actually kind of fun, uh, Calamitous. <coughs> but Plantaro just makes it so broken to the point where like I'm taking all these hits and I'm still just doing perfectly fine There you go for the brother
Yeah, this is just fun. Calamitous is the perfect boss to like test your weapons on at this phase because Plantero is like just a stall battle, so you can't really test your weapons. <coughs> Not yet, at least. <coughs> it's an amazing boss later on to test. But uh, yeah. Wow, we got, we got uh, I didn't even know we got adrenaline. Holy crap! Look at the HP drop. No. Go away. All you guys go away. Ow. Bum holes. But as you can see, this is what I've been doing the entire fight when I uh, first fought Calamitous. <coughs> well, I would just go in circles and circles. And then that's pr practically what I would just do. I would just go in circles and circles and circles until he was dead. <coughs> of course it was longer than that though and I want to try the Taylor weapon because I just wanted to show you guys so I did say I would show you oh my god but it's so bad if you miss there you go it's actually really bad for bosses oh my god it, it doesn't do bad damage it's just like the the times you get your damage out even if you hit the enemy you still have to wait for it to come back and if you look it's following me and you have you either take hits to get your boomerang backs now or you just wait longer <coughs> besides that though it's an amazing weapon like this part this weapon's probably broken for plantera you can probably kill all the babies with like one hit with this so I also want to try this weapon out Oh yeah. This weapon's good, the Skyfin Bombers. But uh, our most broken weapon so far is the cards. There's, there's, there's no doubt about it. <coughs> Look how fast it drops. Look at his brother just drop. This brother's on half HP and I didn't even hit him. That was just a homing scene. <coughs> and there goes his brother. Kind of insane. Ow. How could you do that? We might actually die here. But uh, like I said, I'm not even trying to beat him fully. I'm just like trying to show you guys how broken these weapons are. And just to show you that I didn't get lucky the first match, I'm just trying to do this kind of again. Like, I don't think I'm going to win because I'm not even, like, trying, trying, but still. <coughs> I also didn't use the right weapon at the other time. In the beginning of the battle. Ow. Yeah. But we still got it to 20 HP without even, like, barely trying or trying to dodge. We also didn't have the Iqua buff because it disables the Iqua buff. Um, after the phase 2, so you have to reapply it. And you guys saw me not apply it, so... <coughs> I would love to see this weapon like have an um <coughs> crop. What is it called? A forge on it, so you can see how much more damage it could probably get close to 300. And to be honest, the Molotov is kind of useless with this weapon, so we want to get rid of the Molotov. And let's see what we got from this one. I don't really care though. Yeah, nothing good for me. <coughs> okay, back to the dungeon. <coughs> I think after this, I'm gonna get a video uploaded. <coughs> God, I'm coughing so much. Even though you guys won't know this, but when I... I'm gonna probably be uploading... I think I have to upload Calamitous. But, uh... <laughs> <laughs> this is like what two episodes three episodes before or after calamitous so <coughs> You guys will not really See something like I see a difference or whatever Oh wait the jungle keys right here I just <laughs> deposited all my stuff there you go <laughs> yeah, so now we just have the temple key left. 
which is of course not the not in here so as you can see it isn't the best weapon against any like, it's still amazing against enemies but it's not the best like for instance the Taylor disc is I think just to kill enemies like ready let's see how fast he will drop actually never mind oh crap okay okay I, I understand I understand oh my god let's go cards let's go cards let's go cards yep there you go cards kill cards cards <coughs> yeah, so on single enemies, this is probably one of the most broken weapons like out there. Not really, but really crazy for damage. But uh, when there's multiple enemies, the Taylor Sparks is just the way to go. <coughs> oh my god, I died! <coughs> I'm never gonna be able to kill a Paladin. I'm so bad. I I always get killed by like baby skeletons. <coughs> oh yeah, we got the Keyblade. Cool. Yes, yeah, so now we just have dungeon key. Which is, uh, yet again, I, I will go look for the dungeon off camera just so we have it explored. <coughs> so, not explored, but like on the map. So, whenever we do have to fight Golem, we can just build a, a new arena super fast and easily. Um,. But yeah, I'm gonna have to build a arena on the right side of the ocean because you can't fight Leviathan in the acid rain, so I can't use that arena. So I'm gonna have to build a whole new arena for uh, Leviathan. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry for all this coughing, by the way. I also heard Leviathan is really annoying, but he got a really big nerf where like he's smaller, I guess. So like, he's not too bad anymore. Which is not like a huge, huge nerf, but I guess it made him like, since he was so big, it was like actually impossible, impossible to dodge. Like not like, if you have invincible flames, you could like live him. Like it was my cape scene. Like you just were physically impossible not to dodge him. <coughs> so they made him smaller, which to be honest made him so much easier. Apparently, I don't really know because I haven't fought him yet. But uh, yeah, I think it, I think it's like apparently like, I don't know, balance and unbalance at the same time. <coughs> God, this mage guy is like does so much damage to me. There you go. Ow! 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 There you go. I wanted to vein mine that. That's why I died the first time because I wanted to vein mine these, but I had to um add it to the whitelist. There you go, see? <coughs> Which we don't have to die or worry about dying. Oh god. So we don't have to worry about dying from uh, spikes anymore, but we do have to worry about enemies. Ow, 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 ow. Ow! Stop it! Ow! I understand you guys are strong. Now go away. Yeah, as you can see, like, it, like all these enemies over here. There's so many enemies, and I'm just killing them like so fast with this. So, <coughs> and yeah, we killed the paladin finally. It's not guaranteed drop to get the paladin hammer, but uh, it's just a chance. So we hope I'm gonna hope I can get that, but I don't know. Let's place some banners down for a little bit more damage. Ow, ow, ow. There's a rocket launcher skeleton somewhere around here. <coughs> yes, a rocket launcher skeleton. I didn't say anything wrong there. There's also a sniper skeleton somewhere. Ah! No, yeah, we got him. It's so weird to see the wisp guys because I have my uh, skull. So, like, they blend in, like, right there. I, I thought that was my skull because they were right on top of each other. <coughs> oh, like right next to each other, but still. Oh, let's main mine of that so I don't get hit by that anymore. God, these magic guys are so annoying. I always hated them in the real games, and now they're not insanely annoying as before because now I can actually do decent damage and being able to get, kill them a little bit faster, but 
<coughs> this is kind of annoying. Because unlike before, where it's like, you, you kind of like die if you get hit by them in the real game. But in this, you can actually take some hits and do the damage too. Unlike you don't do the damage and you don't take the hit. It kind of like sucks in real to air. Look at all this ectoplasm we get from those guys. I wish I was winning, just got the shotgun. The tactical shotgun's so good. Well, actually, I don't know about it in uh, Calamity, but... Regularly, it's, I think, like, the weapon to just... Yeah, it is a weapon to, like, beat every boss into post-Moonlord. <coughs> or until Moonlord. Because yeah, qualified bullets will say is like, whole oh, man. Also, people are wondering where the master mode to a place is. I don't know if I'm doing that. <coughs> <coughs> and if people even don't know what I'm talking about is to a 1.4, like real to area, like regular, not modded. Came out with an update where it's called master mode, and it's just a harder version of to area. But all they did was give the um, bosses more HP. Nothing new. That's all it is, just more HP. And the main reason why I don't want to do it is because it's not fun. It, it really is just not fun. And it's lots of luck. And <coughs> as I said before, you don't really do damage. You kind of just like have to sit there and hope on luck. And there's no way to like stop it either. So that's one of the main reasons why I'm not doing it. I might maybe later on. <coughs> but like I might even complete all classes for Calamity death mode until I do that cuz it's like I said it's not fun <coughs> a lot of cool new weapons and stuff but like just like really like more HP not even like for instance death mode did add more HP and more damage reduction but they also gave every single boss new phases and new abilities and they even have like new weapons <coughs> unlike you know regular Everything else is like, you know, just usual. What's this? Oh my god, what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Oh my god, okay, okay, what the- I didn't- I didn't know that. I didn't know this. I didn't know this. I didn't know this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, okay. I think that deserves a- a recall. <coughs> Good to know if I um ever get an item from those guys. It's bad. Put a ecto in there. <coughs> <coughs> so ectoplasm is so huge in this game. And main reason is I will show you why. I think it's called cause. Yeah. So you can get cores on like cores of chaos, cores of limb, and then you make cores of calamity, which is how you make like insane weapons, better weapons, upgrades, and how you just you know do everything. So we're gonna make nine of each. Never mind. <coughs> <coughs> what do I need? Sunlight. Can I make? Can I get sunlight? I know you can make them. Sunlight. I don't think I spelt that right. Nope, I put a, a N, that's why. Hey. Uh. Hmm. 
What? What? What did I do wrong? <laughs> Um, okay. Because I'm so confused. Okay, we're going to go out of this and go back in. Because if you type in, like, chaos, nope, they just don't want to show up, I guess. <coughs> There you go, Calamity. Excuse you. Yeah, see, so now it's showing the stuff. But I want sunlight. <coughs> really? Wyverns can drop it. Let's go kill some Wyverns, I guess. <coughs> <coughs> oh, this open scene's kind of good. We need another grand scale, though, so. Don't know. Okay, let's go up here. Let's get a Zog. Zog! Potion. Wyvern, Wyvern, Wyvern. Goodbye. Yeah, kind of just have to wait here and see if we get a, a Wyvern. <coughs> Oh, why would Oh, crap. Some essence of sunlight. So apparently you guys- yeah, you guys drop a pipe piece, so you- Thank god I put a Zog potion on. I didn't even see that. Yeah, this weapon's so OP on single targets. <coughs> make it night time. Yeah, okay, so wyverns can only spawn at night time. Good to know. There you go. Yep. Since we have a piercing weapon, we kind of just, like, shred them. So, yeah, we'll just, uh, wait at night time to get the items instead of daytime. More sunlight. Ooh, lots of sunlight up here. It seems like every single one's, like, close to guaranteed to drop one. No. Yeah, we got it. <coughs> Bum hole. There you go. Yeah, got it. Another wyvern. Dead though. Okay, now how much sun's like do we have 23? <coughs> <coughs> that should be good enough. Core. So we made one, yeah. There you go, nine. What what uh crap. We need this for a weapon. Oh no. <laughs> My bad. Whoa. Whoa. When do you get Shadow Boy? I want Shadow Boys. Supreme Clamness. Okay. I got you now. What's the weapon I was looking at? Crap. I have it in my inventory, so I can just go back. <coughs> Yeah, that looks really cool. Oh, there's a melee and a rogue. Got it. 
there's something here that I want. <coughs> yeah, we can't do it to post Moon Lord, so we don't get maximum speed. And it does not seem like we can, uh, get really any insane items for us for now. But as you can see, this is all, like, endgame stuff, so. But... <coughs> I do kind of want this. <coughs> yeah, sorry, my bro messed up. Blue Nine Eyes. What is Cosmoy? Devour of Gods? Damn it! Everything's like post everything. Eat my butthole. Magic. No. That's a lot of items. Oh god, that's a lot of items. Oh, this weapon I know is good, yeah. <clears throat> Where do I get this weapon? Whoa. <clears throat> so I get it post Moon Lord. What is this, though? Oh, it's from these guys. I don't know where you find these guys. I'm gonna have to look it up because so much item. Like, yeah, our Paladin Hammer, this Rogue Weapon, is also here. And this armor tactically is also here. Also, off camera, I'm gonna mine the new ore. I think it's called, like, Paninium ore or something like that. I don't really know what it's called. But, yeah, I'll be mining that off camera because that's really boring. So... <coughs> but yeah, now we have those. Uh, I am going to type in core one last time. <coughs> <coughs> I kind of just want to see what one of all these do. Oh, crap. Yeah, this weapon seems cool. Kind of good. I kind of want to see it. I don't even know if it's good or not. It just kind of looks cool. <laughs> Um, I need another grand scale, so I'll fight him. And yeah, that's kind of it. <coughs> um, but yeah, off camera, I'll be doing a good amount of stuff. Off camera, I might grind more Actoplasm. I might not. I probably won't. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna look for the temple so I can open the temple key and stuff just so we have it known and know where it is. <coughs> um, I'll probably set up a Leviathan Arena. I'll probably find another Grand um, Shark so we can get that other type of rogue weapon. And I'm gonna make a new weapon, I mean a new thing for a Scythe, which is like a better thing. It's like a shield that gives us a dash but gives us like 50 percent more damage reduction so we kind of want that <coughs> but yeah you guys saw me do all this stuff in the next episode we'll get some more stuff done so i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye